So guys in this video I will be telling you how can you create your own hosting server for free from Amazon. All you have to do is create an Amazon AWS account and link your credit or debit card. Don't worry guys you won't be charged unless until a year and you, you will be make sure that you receive an email to confirm that you are being charged unless you won't be charged. So just create an account and go to my account and AWS management console or there will be an option to move console just go there click on services go to ec2 and yeah select your region that's a pretty important step because depending upon your traffic you should select your region now go to ec2 and click on launch instance and launch it's very easy guys just follow the steps keep this video on one side and keep your amazon aws on another use the ubuntu server uh, 18 version is amazing or you can use the 16 version depending upon your preference so select this one the free tier version you will be getting 750 hours of EC2 instance which is pretty amazing for a server and yep select the size as 25 or 30 it totally depends upon you well prefer 30 GB it is much better now add tag just it's your wish it is optional step now security just follow the screen guys uh, all tcp all udp https http and rdp and in source select anywhere and proceed and launch after this step and just have a look over it and if it's fine just launch and create a new pair uh, give it a name and download the key pair and please guys keep it safe don't lose it at any cost just make it copy or something and send it to your mail as well as keep it on a pen drive this will be in the format and launch uh, for launching the instance it will take around five minutes so you'll be creating an elastic IP so that every time the machine is restarted your IP won't be lost so go to elastic IP just see on the screen now allocate click allocate yep now click actions allocate and select the machine machine ID and yep this IP and allocate of course your IP addresses will be different and for some hackers don't try to hack this IP because I will be deleting this IP after this video and like you see our server is running just click on right click and connect and the public uh, IPv you are seeing that will be uh, used for our domain and these are the login credentials you will be using putty as an SSH client just install putty all the links will be in the description so don't worry guys it's pretty simple and once you install the putty uh, just open it open putty gen p-u-t-t-y-g-e-n because we will be converting our key to another format so that putty can recognize us putty gen yep then load now you have to select the key that you just downloaded uh, select all files this is an important step and okay and create a safe private key and yes and, and now we have to save the name you can save it as the same name and save now you can of course change the name if you want for simplicity now open putty putty and in the IP address you have to select the text from Ubuntu please see that see on the screen from Ubuntu just copy this and paste it here now you have to go to the option authentication and browse you have to select the file that we just converted okay it will be of this icon and yep open now you will be connected to your host you just select yes for the first time and yep you have created your own hosting service for further information uh, see the second part of this video